but it's up on InfoWars.com and PrisonPlanet.com. Anderson Cooper saying the First Amendment is dead. And then going over how even I, I, I've got a frontline story here uh, of a photographer they'd hired to go down to Texas City and take photos of the BP refinery. This is the same one that had a big leak a few years ago and they got a big fine over it. And the cops showed up and they said, we don't care. You don't take photos in America. I uh, was coming back from the beach about a year ago. And this was down in Corpus Christi. I was coming back from Port Aransas. And I was getting on an access road and saw this big refinery. And I said, you know, I always need B-roll for my films. And I want to expose how the carbon tax is meant to shut down our society. And I might mention that the big oil companies are actually financing it and that they got together in 96. This has been declassified. Well, not declassified. The AP Associated Press sued and uh, got those minutes in 2000. We've written articles about it and covered it. If you want to go pull the, the stories up where they shut down all of the uh, refineries that they didn't own or bought them up and closed them to create an artificial bottleneck because there's too much oil. And so they want to keep prices up. How do they do that? They shut down refining capacity. They fund environmental groups who go out and lobby against it. And then they themselves sit back and make fun of the very groups they financed. I mean, this is on record. So that's how they create that artificial scarcity. And I, I, this is no exaggeration. I pulled up by that big refinery right before you get on 37 to go north. I pulled up. I got out with a video camera on a tripod and filmed the refinery. I cut down a side street, and the refinery was about two miles away. It's just a giant, sprawling facility. There were no cars around me, no one around me. I got in my car, driving a minivan, got on the highway, entrance ramp, got back on the highway, and violently coming down from another entrance ramp was a Texas State Police officer who got right up on my butt, ran my plates, put me in a database, then peeled off. Didn't pull me over. That is infrastructure protection. They're watching everything, ladies and gentlemen. And they tell those poor state police guys, Al-Qaeda is going to blow up the chemical plant. Give me a break. But they can't stop the open border. So the same thing happened to this um, PBS photographer.